Hello everyone, and welcome back to another episode of Feed the Beast. This is Selic, and I've been making a mess, but I cleaned up. I've been uh, grassing the area up a little bit, adding some trees. I um, made myself a skeleton spawner. Uh, my Let's see, right now my soul shard, I believe it's around 600 or so, so I stopped around 5... 512, I think, is the number for Tier 4. Stuck it in there, and uh, was leveling up quite a bit. You can see how many skeletons I've killed by how many stacks of arrows and bones I have. I have no idea. I guess I'll just recycle all these. I don't know. But I've been enchanting some books, and, um, yeah, I um, f had two Soul Stealer 3 enchantments on books, and so I uh, combined them and the one vial sword um, for Soul Stealer 4. Thanks for the tip on that. So um, I've been uh, killing spiders, or spiders, skeletons a lot faster. I also made a, a little, you can actually see it on the map there. I'm going to get the mini map. Right underneath here, I think it's right there, I made a, um, a little, s I found a slime chunk. So I hollowed, hollowed out some, um, like a 3 by it's like 3 high by, what, 16 by 16? And uh, actually filled up, using my soul stealer, filled up a uh, soul shard already. So, yeah, uh, I've been pretty busy with that. Also, I've been um, working on the front entrance here. Made some pretty nifty columns here. And uh, working on a bit of a bridge. Right now it's a bridge to nowhere, but, you know, I don't know how far back we're going to go this way, but um, we'll see. I don't know yet. Uh, as you can tell, I've hollowed out the uh, ceiling a bit more. I rounded off, well, not too round, but rounded off the edges a little bit here and here. And, um, yeah, so I think it's coming along pretty well down here. I want to keep making it bigger and bigger. Um, that's still my floor. That's I don't want to go above that in my hollowing. So I want to still be uh, going down and out a little bit more this way. And, oh, you can see here, I also harvested a volcano. Uh, I was over by the um, stronghold portal to the end, and I uh, spent uh, an evening just working on uh, harvesting out the, the volcano, and then I tried making some elaborate furnace-ing this way, but I ended up deciding just to go with a hopper, Put a whole bunch of overclockers in here, and uh, yeah, just been doing it manually. It just works out just fine. Not a big deal. Um, so yeah, uh, and that's obviously in the works. We're going to be uh, building our volcano upward at some point. Um, and you know, I guess I should go ahead and reveal it. Remember last last episode, I said that I was uh, wearing someone else's skin. Uh, what? Mm, yeah, that's sort of gross. I was use. I appeared to be the Minecraft player of a person who was already playing Minecraft. Anyways, uh, so you know, hindsight being twenty twenty, um, going to a popular Minecraft skin website and then picking a cool skin uh, is probably not the best idea <laughs> because if I thought it was cool, someone else's. You know, someone else probably thinks it's cool as well. So, anyways, I went and I made my very own me. Uh, replaced every pixel. I kept some of the things that I liked. Um, just, well, I'll show you. Ready? Ta-da! Hi. I'm Selick. <laughs> I like, uh, uh, he has a big cheesy grin. And um, so you can see, I, I, I still needed the goggles. But these goggles are way better. They have green lenses. Protect my eyes really well. And, um, yeah, you can see I have some interesting pants. I'll look at the back. There you go. That's me from the back. Hello. But I'm pretty pleased with it. I, you know, I may tweak some pixels here and there, uh, just because I'm a tweaker, I guess. Wait. I like to tweak things. <sighs> Anyways. Um, yeah, and I have some gloves, which I think are very important when you're working on things like... Uh, the industrial craft stuff. You need gloves, for sure. So yeah, here I am, and I like it. I like it a lot. Um, let's go ahead and get our stuff back on. Oh yeah, and I enchanted my jumper boots. 
<laughs> yeah, that's all I need. Okay. Hey. So. Um. Yeah. So what we're gonna work on today? The first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna work on these columns. So. Um. Let me show you something. Let me show you. So, uh, to make a circle in Minecraft can be fairly interesting, I'll say that. Um, when you're doing a 5x5 five five circle, what you do, this is technically a 5x5 five five circle oops, in Minecraft. So it's you know 5 this way, 5 that way, but um, yeah. But I didn't want to make my columns exactly a circle. So what I did was I made them, I'll show you, it's it's like a diamond shape. And basically what it allows you to do, let's move over to this way, this way just a little bit. What it allows you to do is make a, um, sort of like a sideways square. So you see this would be a square this way, but it's a diamond. But I feel like that's too... I feel like the edges of the column stick out too much. I'll stop moving. So what I'm thinking about doing, I want to compare these side by side. I also was doing a little bit with uh, th this. These are stone micro blocks. And I sort of like that, but I'm not sure yet. Uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to take, cut down this side here and this side here, and also on this side and in the back. And I'm going to replace that with half slabs. So um, let me let me get some materials together, and uh, then we'll start to work on that, and we'll see what what we can uh, what we can do with this, and see if we can make it a little more or less sticky outy. But maybe we like it that way. I guess I don't know. We'll see. Let me uh, get some stuff together, and we'll start building. Earlier, I forgot to mention uh, a thank you to whomever I, I can't remember who who said this to me, but to uh, enable seeing mobs. In your mini map, very cool entities radar. So I, I enabled that, and I just have uh, monsters and slimes. But uh, that's very, very nice to have, especially when you're lighting up caves and you're like, I'm sure there's dark spots somewhere, uh, and you can actually find it on the mini map. You can sort of go to them. the The way it works is, if you don't know, um, let's see if we can find. Well, maybe difficult. Um, the way it works is. Well, you can see right there. See the bottom left corner? There are some that are sort of bright red, and then you see some that are sort of dimly red. The bright red means that I am uh, basically on the same level with them, um, the Y level. And uh, the dimmer they are, they're either above you or below you. And so you can figure that out by climbing or, or uh, digging down. And you can go and find those extra caves that um, that those guys are dwelling in and light that up. So anyway, so I'm going to start going down, and I'm too cheap to, <laughs> to use my silk touch pick because I can pretty easily just cook some more. Not a big deal. So you, I'm going to go down the. Come on, this way. Go down there. One, two, three, and it's mostly hollow, as you can see. Yeah, so I'm gonna go on down here a little ways, and I'll, I'll probably go ahead and do this, that column, and or sorry, that the front side, and then also the other side, and then we will uh, we'll take a look at it and see see what you think. Hmm. Hmm. Right. There are some things I like about it. Let me sit down here. Okay. Hmm. There are some things I like about it, but there's one thing that really sort of bugs me. Can you guess what it is? Yeah, it's the lighting glitch. It just, I don't know, it doesn't look as clean to me. And maybe it loses some of it, its epicness? I don't know. I'm torn. I'm torn. Let me know what you think. Do you like the... Well, I didn't change out the back, so <laughs> ignore the back, please. Um, do you like the the more narrow column? A little rounder? 
or do you like the uh, the more diagonal one here? Hmm. Okay, well, we'll leave that for now. The other thing I'd like to work on is I would like to uh, work on this a little bit. I'm going to show you my plan. Let me get rid of this stuff here first. I'm going to show you my plan. I don't know how well it will work out. Um, but it's worth trying, right? Okay, so, okay, we need some dirt. Need some dirt. That's more than enough. Too much, actually, but that's okay. Alright, so now, what I would like to, let's do this first one here. Okay, so we're going to go down like this. And we'll go down to here. I'll have to pillar up, actually. Here. Oops. I just realized that I got rid of one of my important components here. Alright, so let's get up here and build this sucker up. Get rid of you. Oh, not that much. I like that thing, but it's just great that the uh, mining drill, it's cool. Okay, so this, that's okay. So let me show you. This may be just a little crazy. A little on the edge. <laughs> it's going to lose all the tension, all the drama, <laughs> the big reveal, because I can't find anything. Oh, I hate creepers. Okay. Um, is it going to be the last one I look in? I guess the worst thing, it would be worse if I actually s looked in it already. Come back here. Aha! It was the last one I looked in. Buckets of lava. Woohoo. Okay. <laughs> lava... You probably know this. Lava makes a massive, massive mess if you're not careful. And um, these things may... You know what? I need, I need to have, like, a reserve bucket of water. Because if I need to put this thing out, it's going to be bad news. Okay. Please do the right thing. Whew. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Yeah, what do you think? I don't know if... I might just have some floating... Um, we're going to do this very carefully. You know, maybe a couple of these around, just sort of floating there. I don't know. Let's look at it. Let's take a step back. Dangerous. Dangerous, right? But sort of cool. Right, let's do the next one. Let's do the next one. I'll put a torch back here before I forget. All right. Right here. Okay. Ooh, let's put on hover mode. Hmm. Yeah, I've had a lot of bad experiences with, uh, with lava. Let's make you a different size or a different place. Um, because, man, once it starts going... It just keeps going. All right. Oh, we need more lava. I hear an Enderman. You hear him? Don't come steal my dirt, buddy. What's oh, another thing I noticed? The um, lighting glitches, man. You see that? It's crazy. And then this. That's on. Wait. Shoot. What is it now? I don't know. I guess we have to see if it's... I don't know if it's on or off. I'll just have to watch the bar and see if it's like... the charge is going down. Okay. Next. We'll have to put like a glass plate or something on top of that. Okay. <laughs> I'm okay with jetpack. Well, I'll need it some soon. Hmm, let's watch it come down. It's sort of cool looking. 
I might make these floating islands out of something a little different. Okay. Remove it by hand. Better to be safe than sorry. Don't think it would be that instantaneous, but whatever. I don't know, maybe I'll make them out of iron or something. Okay. Whew. Let's take a look at this now. Interesting. Well, I don't know. I might spread them out a little bit more. You know, maybe make them every, instead of every four, make them every eight. Yeah, one, two, three, four. So, well, cool. I think that's going to be pretty nice. Let me go ahead and finish these two up, these next two up, and then um, we'll take a look at it, and then uh, there's a couple more things I want to do this episode, so we will uh, get to that next. All right, here they come. All the way down. You're going to get it right? Yes, yes. All right. Yeah, not bad, not bad. You know what I might end up doing is just making it all the same level. I, I'm, I'll mess around with it some more and uh, and see what I can come up with. But uh, the next thing I wanted to do um, was I wanted to work on some boulder making. The forest here, I want, you can see I started, I, try, I tried a little bit of a prototype here. Um, and it's okay. Um, yeah, it's not terrible. <laughs> How's that for a evaluation? Eh, you're not terrible. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so I had some... Here you are. I have that. Okay, so let's go check this out. Oh, and yeah, if you watch my first episode, you'll remember I have a very distinct opinion about grass. In general, I do not like it. But I noticed that as I was uh, trying to make a forest floor around here, it really didn't look that good. Just plain. Um, and so I'm pushing back just a little bit from that normal <laughs> instinct that I have. Uh, I guess in the same way I'm, I push back from my instinct to be symmetric and have everything nice and neat according to my OCD part side of me. All right, let's lay down a... Yeah. So anyways, yeah, I'm, I'm trying new things, I guess you could say. I'll put you there, and there's put one back here. About no here, not there. Here. Now let's try maybe this and this. Maybe this. It's it looks like a stair step. I don't like that. Don't want a stair step. How about that? Oh, <laughs> back to the stair step again. Yeah, let me stop and just stare at it for a moment. What do you think of that? Not bad. Maybe not as terrible? No, I, that, that really isn't that all that bad. Oops. Hmm. Happy accident? Perhaps? Let's do this. Can I do that? I can't. I can do that though. No. Let's make the let's cut this guy in half. Yeah. Hmm. Now that's a little more interesting, huh? What do you think? Yeah, so I want to have some boulders around the area. Let's take, let's get rid of you. Put you back here. That'll turn to grass. That might be a little bit better. 
Let's get a high altitude view here. See, that's not symmetric, really. And um, I could pass for a boulder jutting out of the uh, the woodland floor. Yeah, looks pretty cool. Hmm. All right, well, um, and we're out. Let's see, yeah, okay. Um, another thing I wanted to mention, I just realized that as I was looking at my um, sugarcane farm, um, some big changes, looks like some big changes are going to be made in forestry. I don't know if you've heard about this, uh, and I don't know that I like the changes, but um, yeah, I don't know, we'll see. They're going to be getting rid of these types of blocks, these harvester blocks, these um, the arboretums, I believe is how you pronounce it. The logger. They're going to be getting rid of it uh, in favor of a more complex, expensive uh, style of... Um, yeah, they're get, getting rid of the farm. It's going to be one uh, farm that is a multiple has multiple uses depending on the kind of... Uh, I believe it's like a microchip that you can stick in it. Uh, you, the kind that you build with the um, trans transatlantic <laughs> what is that thing called? I have one around here. You can make these things with it. Trans you know what I'm talking about. If not um, it's not a big deal. It's a big deal. i got to figure it out. It used to be all in one box, and I knew right where that box was, and now, of course, it's not there. It's not there. It's not there. <sighs> Never mind. Never mind. It's, you build stuff with it. So, yeah, you, you can make the, the chips, and you put it in the, to the farm, and the farm is like, it's like a huge, um, way more expensive, and not as big, and, yeah... It's it's going to make the game more challenging for sure. So I think maybe in an upcoming episode we will look into that. Um, I hope that they're getting all the bugs. Um, it's called a multi-farm. The block's already in the game. You see it here. Uh, so you put, put it together. You have just the farm blocks and then you have these specialized um, blocks. And so you can sort of design it however you want to. There's a farmland block. Interesting. But yeah, all these things are here. They're going to be getting rid of them. So um, that will be, like I said, an upcoming episode. We can check that out. Um, yeah, but we're going to finish up this, finish up the episode doing a one more building project. And um, it's probably going to be a building project that I start. Um, but I don't know that I'll get it finished because it's a big deal. It's a, it's a lot of stuff. And I will go check it out now. Get rid of you. We don't need that. Yeah, I don't know. We might need that. A bunch of these. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Really quick. It's nighttime, and one of my favorite things to do when it's nighttime is to go skeleton hunting. Yeah. Let's see if there's any skeletons about. I'll try to get them when they're not near any other mob. We'll see how this goes. Oh, oh froze. Unfreeze. Hi. Ooh. Yep. So I just spend the evenings or the night times. <laughs> you can see what I've, where I've been. Spend the evenings uh, dive bombing. Ooh. Skeletons. Oh, there's one almost by yourself. Here we go. Alright. Whew. Oh, wrong button. This thing's almost done. There we go. Whew. So yeah, that's uh, it's my nightly ritual. 
So let's um, tell you what we'll, we'll do. We're going to get to our next, um, our next and last project. But uh, before I do that, I'm going to go take a nap. I hope. We'll see if I can do it before he gets here. Yeah. All right, I'll be back. Okay, so I mentioned earlier something I'd like to start doing. I want to go ahead and start at this episode. Um, and because it's a, I find it's a pretty um, tedious task. I might, you know, work on it a bit and then stop and then work on it a bit and stop. And that is mountain building. As you see, I've started a little bit here. I worked on this the other day, just trying it out just to see what it'd be like. And um, I think this is a good height. Let's, let's move over, over here just a little ways. And, uh, oh, there's a creeper there. i got to take care of him. I think it's going to be a better height. This height right here, this is just at jetpack height. I can go above it, but then it takes me right back down again. Seems like they may have, did they raise jetpack height? Okay, so this is hover mode. They did. They raised it. Because before, I could barely get on that platform. So we'll probably come up a little bit higher then. Interesting. So, let me show you my general technique. We're going to go down this way. Is the creeper still there? He's gone. Good. Okay. So I go down to... I, I find the edge of where the current... Well, see, this is a little bit different. Over here on the edge, it's easy for me to find where the, uh, basically where the, the basalt ends on the mountain. So let's go over here. And, you know, obviously, this can always be changed. One of the be beautiful things of Minecraft. Just line ourselves up. And we'll start here. And I'll go up. Go ahead and take my jetpack off. I'll save some energy. What should I get rid of? Definitely. Plenty of those. Okay. So, I'll go up like seven, maybe. And then a bunch more. Three, four, five, six, seven. Over. One, two, three, four, five. And I just try to vary it. And then gauge how m much closer. I think I'm going to go, you see I sort of started off pretty steep. And then the, the intervals got a little bit shorter and shorter. And sort of rounded it up at the top there. So I'll go just like this. Oops. See, sometimes, and those kind of accidents, I just leave them alone. Two, three. One, two, three. Four. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, we're getting pretty close. One, two, three. One, two. One, two, three. Four. One, two, three, four. And that that's pretty good. So let's take a look at that. So yeah, it's not bad. Um, and honestly, this is not the very this is not a very interesting part here because um, it's going to get interesting as these things get closer and closer together. But see how that makes it a very, you see I went on a really long one there, makes it a very shallow sort of um, part of the mountain, which I don't know that I mind. Uh, I might need to come out a little bit more as I consider what I'm going to be building up here. I have a few ideas. Um, let's see. Okay, my jetpack's okay. Let's go over to this other creeper hole here, or next to it. And I want to show you um, another, I guess, thing I'm thinking about when I'm building this. You see how on the left here, um, 
that's sort of where the volcano starts. Um, and so, you know, I could go up like this, but that may be a little too big. I think I went in too far here, so I might do something like that. Just uh, try it again. Just a little bit further up, flowing down into the mountainside here. And then on this side, I definitely want it to be a lot more sheer, a lot more straight up. You see, I went a little more straight up here. I might even go a little bit more. That cloud's blocking the way. So yeah, going straight up this way to right there. I don't know. What do you guys think about that? I'm I'm going to be working on this off camera uh, here and there and try to try to work on it. To uh, I like to work on things and stare at them for a little bit to see if I like them or not. So, um, you know, I'm going to do that. I'm going to keep going on that. And um, next episode, we'll take a look at that. Uh, but that's going to be it for this episode. I really appreciate you guys watching. Um, I, again, I enjoy all the feedback and the comments and the, the tips and the help. Uh, and I really appreciate it. So, um, yep, yeah, thanks, guys. And uh, I will see you again next time. <laughs>